Hello there. I've just come into my weekly vegan food shop at Tesco. So I'm going to run through it with prices, explaining all the deals they've got on at the moment. Quick scan and everything else. So I'll start off at this end. I've got the Jason Sourdough Great White Bread. I got that, the Great White because I had a good day on it. That was £2. And part of the meal deals, I picked up the Appy Plant Based Breaded Shrimpy. I've had the shrimpy before but i've never had it breaded so it's more like scampi and i thought well that'd be nice with some coleslaw maybe and some chips one night or mayonnaise i don't know but i just thought i'd pick it up because i've not tried it part of the review i need to do that i picked up a mango and passion fruit coconut yogurt for one pound 80 from the collab collection i've had it before i've had them before but not the mango and passion fruit they had that or raspberry and i'm not the biggest fan of the raspberry and yet i love raspberry so go figure part of the three for two deal as well i've got the meatless farms the Nujeva sausage ravioli, which is really nice, a bit spicy, as I said before. So I picked that up as part of the deal. I got two of the GU Spanish lemon plant, because I had the zillionaires last week, and they were lovely, but I love lemon. And they're on offer at 285 which is still quite expensive, but I thought I'd give them a go. Again, part of the part deal, I got the squeaky bean. I've had it a long time ago last, pastrami. I haven't had it in a long time, but I thought I'd have a go. I'll go through the deal bits in a minute. I picked up a bowl. Fresh Noodle Thai Green, I really like that one. And um, so I've got that one. The Richmond Sausage, which I haven't had in a long time, part of the deal. And two, Plant Chef No Chicken Kiev, which I've always stated, I believe are the second best, only behind Marks and Spencers. I've got the Planted Tikka. I made a mistake there last week, I said they had Lemonur. Lemonur are the small pieces, they only have a Tikka one in the kebab style, which is really nice. So I picked another one up. It's got the noise in the background. And, and I've also picked up an Iguidi Roasted Tomato Broccoli and Spinach Quiche. And finally, the Wicked, I really like this one out of all of them, Meat Free, Osteen and Rice, Wheat wheat and Pea Protein. I really, really like that one. So that's normally 4 20 so I've got that, that, which is 4 60 normally, and they're normally £4. So the, tea, the kebabs were free, basically. Then I got, I want to get these the right way around. Do it for you. So then I got the bowl. Which is normally three pound, three twenty-five for the ravioli and three pound for the shrimpy. So basically, the bowl was free. And then I got the squeaky bean, which is normally two fifty, two fifty, two forty-five. So they were free, and that's how it works. It gives you the cheapest one free. So I've got a few different things to try. It's always nice, and I try to keep it a bit verified, for obviously, for us in the videos um i picked up my favorite ones the black grape finest black grapes which really expensive at two pound thirty really but they're my sweet indulgent you can have one right now yeah sweet indulgence one of your public keep refrigerated they won't see the fridge which is better than saying that than a packet of biscuit isn't it i picked up two avocados so i can do some sourdough avocado toast do an offer from 195 uh, from 95 pence to 79 pence not a massive saving, but a saving nevertheless. I've got three pairs, and they came to 244, which I thought was quite expensive for it, really. I've got four of the Growers Darvish Soya Drink and Sweet. I always go for the unsweet, and they're 50 pence each. Two large sweet potatoes. Three very small braid when happened. They were very small, but they came to 120 something. Two bunches of bananas, large bunch of bananas. Plant Chef Cozo. It's um, one pound five pence. I just thought instead of making a big batch and buying that, I haven't got a cabbage in the fridge at the moment. I just thought, buy the small back at uh, do the job, and you've got no waste. Two broccolis for one pound. The chestnut mushrooms for one pound ten. The green beans, because I used the last lot in the, um, in the curry. The green beans were eighty five pence, and finally, last but not least, packet at least they were one thirty nine that packet. But I'm thinking of making a leaking mushroom phyllo pie again the basically the matt pritchard the dirty vegans recipe so not going to steal it for myself but do that or on an alternative because it's very similar to it so that's my weekly vegan food shop with prices you know i'm sorry it's um it's a lot but not a lot if you know what i mean i've got all the basics i need a bit of sweet stuff there and there some sandwich fillers some bread and the basics and a meal a day basically in amongst that lot and I've still got the salmon fillets to use that from the previous shot. So that's it. If you've got this far, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps the algorithms. And it's really appreciated because the more alg the algorithm get picked up, the better. So I'm going to have another great. Um, please feel free to leave a comment.
I haven't forgot. Wait till some Marks and Spencer's comparison shop will be done. And the next day, by tomorrow. Or, video will probably go out on Monday, to be honest with you. So that'd be interesting, because they're the premium brands, aren't they, really? So we'll see. If you've got any comments, please leave them. I appreciate it. If you haven't already, you can get this far. Basically, the channels, food, vegan food reviews, vegan food shops, dogs running around on shorts. Uh, and not in shorts, on short form, because I keep meaning to put, put the GoPro on, frankly, but I haven't done it. And, um, you know, if you could get used to this kind of thing, please subscribe, that'd be amazing. But more importantly, please, more than anything else, just please take care and stay safe. Till the next one, thanks again for watching. Bye.